Okay, just before we get started, I'm going to have to excuse the bird sounds you might hear and the pitter-patter tippy-taps of this one. We're just going to get that out of the way right now. Anyway, enjoy the episode. Hello again and welcome back to Mimsy Park. Today we are doing something different, actually. Brittany ordered... I bought something. Some animation cells. Ah! What are these animation cells from? L Little Nemo. Little Nemo in Slumberland, to be more precise. And you got... These are like legit animation cells. Yes! Like legit animation yeah, cells. Yeah, I'm supposed to have five. But the cool thing is, is that they're random, so I don't really know what ones I got. Now you're hoping for specific ones, right? I want Bon Bon or Flip, if okay. you've seen the uh, animated movie. This is a 1980s animation, but actually... 89. I, 89. It came out the year I was born. I, I, I remember watching this as like a kid. Turn them upside... First of all, are they all in one thing? Okay. <laughs> They're all in one thing. Oh, shit. Okay, so... I okay. stop looking. Okay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Don't look. Try not to look. Okay, first of all, for the purists, we do have the certificate. It says this artwork is one of a is a one of a kind authentic original piece of art that was used in the production of this cartoon. There are no two alike in the world. Jacob White and he actually it's Jacob. It's, Jacob. <laughs> it's, it's totally Jacob. And then it's from Animation Legends. Now, should we maybe should I pull these out and surprise you with them? Yes, Show one by one because this is like a big deal okay. for me. I love this movie. Everything about it. Okay. And I'm okay. I'm excited for anything they give me. Okay. They could give me a hand and I'd be okay. All right, let's go. Here's one. Maybe I'll print some background. Okay, guys. So I got the professor. <laughs> yes. I'm gonna bring this up a little yes. closer so Show you guys can see it. Show the professor to my friends. <laughs> He's so great. Okay. Um, that is a win. That is number yes, one. Definitely All right. win. So All right, next number one. two. Okay, my eyes are closed. Is it good? Open your is eyes. Is it good first? I don't know. I don't know what scene this is from. <laughs> I don't know this as much as you do. Okay. Alright, let's go. Oh, oh man. Alright, so. What is this scene from? This this is before he opened the nightmare door because he is wearing Flip's jacket and hat. Interesting. Um, so okay. this is after he started hanging out with Flip and uh, they went on their little adventure. So this is actually him hanging out with Flip at some point and I'm pretty great about it. I'm pretty happy about it. Interesting. Okay. Oh, I think... Did I get Bon Bon? Don't yeah, tell me. I, I, tell that me. I, don't, I wouldn't know to don't be Don't tell me. If I didn't, I'm so um, happy. I'm honestly happy. Like I said, I'd be I, happy if they gave me a hand. Okay, I'm going to show them and then I'm okay. going to show you. Okay, I'm not, I'm is, not looking. Even I'm sitting here going, holy crap. So, I did see the reviews on these bundles were really good, so I'm hoping it's a good one. What is this that came with it? <gasps> what is this? This is insanity. What is it? I need you to open your eyes. Okay. I need you to open your eyes. <gasps> It that came with the hand. Should not Look, have happened. That the wasn't marker. Even... I mean, you can see the marker on the back here. Even I have goosebumps right now. Like this is that is. I don't know. And see, here's the thing. I don't know enough about animation um, to really know. So they draw them and then they print them on the cells. And this is actually what they flip. So on this print. is like the straight up model That's... for the cells. Yeah, so they probably did a rough draft with these, and then this was the final drawing that they did to create the animation cell itself. So what would these X's be on here? Which is what they would flip here? over and over, like flip to the next page to create to create the animation. So this is actually the final drawing for the animation cell itself. Not something I paid for, but it's really cool that they threw it in. I don't know. Just so you know, on this scene, if you were asking about it, this is towards the beginning, actually, when the professor comes in and meets Nemo to take him to Slumberland for his first time. This is iconic a little bit, because this is kind of how it all starts. This is his first greet, and he kind of like bumbles into the, um, yeah. These are all getting top. framed. This is a big deal. They sent the animation with that. That is 
something that, like I said, I did not pay for or was negotiated with. So it's really cool that they sent me like the actual drawing. That's it. like. It's a big deal. Kind of insane. Actually. That is awesome. I'm gonna actually go for the last one in the package here. It's a good thing this is leather because you might f it yourself <laughs> for the last one. I'm already f***ing myself. So this I'm gonna show great. this to everybody. Hopefully this will come in focus there. There we go. Okay. What are we on, number three? This is number four. Okay, am I ready to look? What scene is this from? What scene are we looking at here? Yeah, this is actually probably when he first came into Slumberland and he's hanging out with the princess, with Icarus. I, I, um, I'm that's what I would there. go I'm with. I'm afraid that you'll accidentally see the next one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I would go with is this is probably in that first scene when he's meeting the princess um, before he meets Flip because he doesn't have his coat on yet. Mm -hmm. um, so I'm guessing this is probably in the room with the princess when he's meeting her for the first time with uh, little Icarus. It's okay, she'll make me rewatch it and we'll be, we'll be that's finding exactly out. That's exactly what we're doing. Anyway, like, um, okay, so <laughs> close your eyes. Okay. I need you to close your eyes. Okay. I need everyone else to see this first. I need to see, I need you to see that like, oh. I mean, you're just gonna have to look at this. Don't do it yet, but I want everybody else to see this. Maybe, maybe, camera, maybe camera. Oh my God. I don't know what malfunction you're having. Thanks, Cannon. <laughs> Is this, okay, you know what, here we go. Should we post here. photos of them at the end of this video, we maybe? We probably will. Okay. There's a good chance. All right. So this is the next one right here. I mean, <laughs> just go ahead and open, okay. just go ahead and open your eyes. <laughs> it's, I mean, it's got the original Japanese in here. I mean, somebody with their hand made that thing. And then they made that thing do like tons of other things. Oh man, this is great. So this is Flip. Flip is probably my favorite character. Oops, that was right um, into the camera, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Flip and Bon Bon are probably my two favorite characters in this animated film. Um, I'm actually trying to get through the um, old comic strips as well here soon. This is a great scene, so this is Flip. This is actually in the upside down room. I don't know if you guys remember this. It's a very iconic scene when they're opening up a door and it comes into this whole like mansion-esque type of room, but everything is upside down. This is actually a scene that was used in the video game as well, if you ever played that. Um, probably like my, that. that is my favorite scene in the video game. As far as the movie goes, maybe not my favorite scene, but like a high up there. And I love that I actually got like an actual flip piece. And that clearly happened. Like Brett said, there are like little notes down here in uh, Japanese, I assume, maybe. You probably. know what, in fact, with that said, <laughs> if anybody speak, if anybody speaks Japanese. Oh, please translate. Cause I'm pretty sure. If you can that's see what... these, if you can see these. If it'll focus, there we go. If you can see these, I'm trying to get them in the light. In and the we best. might have you take some good photos. Yeah, I might take some close up photos. In fact, I'm just gonna insert a photo right here. And we're gonna go ahead and just ask that if anybody knows Japanese, if you can translate these, um, there was another one in here. Oh, I don't think it has, it has like, no, it says B. I don't think it had any notes on No, it, it didn't. This, this one straight up has like notes on it. And it's probably because real. his actual motion is he's opening up the door at that time and he actually like slips out a little bit. So they're probably prepping for that next move that happens. Is what I'm guessing the note is about, is uh, just letting know, letting them know what the next movement needs to be. Even separate from like Little Nemo, and the whole movie and everything. It just, this is how people made cartoons. This so epitomizes my love for Disney and old school Disney. I'm tempted to hand you money, actually, <laughs> um, so that you can go get more of them. But I mean, these are in amazing shape. They were, I mean, they really are. All in all, how do you feel about I, your order? I'm like amazed a little bit. Yeah. I knew it was gonna be good just because I saw some of the reviews. I was. I know some people are worried they'll get like a hand or like, you know, like a weird face part that doesn't make sense. 
Um, but I had full complete pieces and I'm very pleased with that. Complete pieces that you can actually attribute to specific scenes. It was something that was big in my childhood and I was actually a little impressed that people didn't know this movie as much as I thought. Um, but what this is, is this is a collector that um, buys by the bundle basically when someone releases a lot of stuff. And uh, I actually know he was fighting between this one and uh, the little toaster at the time. The brave little toaster? Yeah, the brave little toaster. And he ended up buying this lot instead to flip and uh, flip. Like, nah, I got it. Because the, <laughs> the thing and the thing and the thing. Yeah, I got um, it. But I was very lucky. Apparently, like, popular opinion was that Little Nemo was a better movie, but it still wasn't as known as I thought it would be, which is why they sold it at such a decent price. But I. Yeah, you just started a battle in my comment section, right? Oh, I'm sure, because they're both amazing movies. I can't, I can't pick one. I'm what do you think, or... Brave Little Toaster or Little Nemo, which is better? I'm not gonna lie. Uh, total Disney fanatic. <laughs> um, I grew up with the Brave Little Toaster as a kid. Um, I also watched this a lot when I was a kid. I gotta say, from an overall perspective. I gotta give it to Little Nemo and some I, I do too. I mean, you've got your old comic strips that started that to begin with. Yeah. The were they full, didn't you tell me at one point they were full page and he was doing them daily? Oh, it was crazy. So if you look into Little Nemo, which if you guys have seen this animated I'll post movie something before, up here for you. Yes, definitely look into old comic strips. Um, you might find out this is an expensive hobby for it is. you, as I'm finding. It is. It's why we only have these. <laughs> But uh, it's really hard to even find books that have full compilations of it. In fact, I don't think they have one out there that has every one in it. Um, they break it down by certain year genres, and I think most of those collection sets aren't even finished, so you can't get all of it. And these are straight up clippings. And this is full clippings, and what they did, it was full newspaper sheets that they used to do these comic strips on, and to translate them, even some of the ones that they've reprinted that people don't even fully love because it wasn't printed at the scale that he was used to working with. Right. Um, which Wait, is, what was the scale he was used to working oh, with? Oh, like full newspaper sheet. Oh, like I see, he'd get I a full see. sheet. Okay. And okay. so he could really play with that and create these huge dramatic scenes, like spaces. But anyway, guys, <laughs> I hope you did enjoy this episode. This was, uh, this is a lot of fun. Like even to me, this was exciting. Like even to me, I thought this was pretty freaking cool. I don't think I even addressed the uh, scenery change here. I just figured we would switch it up a little bit. We're here. Yeah. We have no makeup on. We're good. <laughs> Who cares? Anyway, guys, if you did enjoy the episode, go ahead and throw us a like. If you didn't enjoy it, go ahead and throw a thumbs down. You can throw us some constructive criticism in the comments. If you are enjoying the episodes, go ahead and throw us a subscription. It does help. I know um, we're going to try and get Brittany in on more of these. She doesn't really get into the movie reviews as much as I do simply because she doesn't care as much as I do. And that's okay. Again, again, if you like them, like, comment. Thumbs down, up, whatever, subscribe, comments, I'm getting ahead of myself. We'll see you guys next time.